What's going on, everybody? This is Joe. And Amy. And we are back with another episode of Pokemon Sapphire, Amy's third it's journey. so weird to hear you say. I know. It's weird for me to remember saying, <laughs> uh, to remember to say it correctly. Uh, but it's Amy's third journey through the world of Pokemon. Last time, we made our way through uh, Rustboro, I believe. Uh, and we tried to fight the gym. And we came kind of close, maybe. But we did not succeed. Uh, and so we came up here to the northeast of the town to train our Surskit and our Lotad up a little bit. So as we can see, Surskit's at about half health and Lotad is still at full. Do we want to uh, keep going or go back to the center for Surskit? Uh, I think we keep going, but maybe we switch Surskit out. I mean, they're sure. both level 11 now. Sure, you got it. <laughs> um, and Torchic is nine, so I yeah. feel like we should, you know, uh, train up the rest of these guys now. <laughs> oh, interesting. Okay, I misunderstood. Sure. So we will, like, so you want, like, Ralts in the front kind of a thing, and then... Yeah. Okay. So we'll go like that, and like that, and then like that. Okay. Very good. Um, well, there's a trainer right here. Are we good sure. with that? Or possibly a trainer. Let me teach you how strong my adorable Pokemon is. Okay. <laughs> it's Last Janice. Or Janice? Why would I say Janice? That name is 100% Janice. <laughs> Holy crap. All right, well, I feel Jan like she's one of Britney Spears' background dancers. From the original, like her first, <laughs> oops, I did it again, music video or whatever? <laughs> baby One More Time. Thank you, Baby One More Time. That's the one. <laughs> yeah. What a, what a terrible 90s kid I am. Anyway, it, you know, good old Janice over here. God, yeah. I'm such an idiot. Okay, anyway, <laughs> Janice would like to battle. Are you sure that song came out like 2000, 2001 that is, anyway? There is almost no chance that's true. Really? I would. All right, everybody. Everybody gets oh, to no. wait while Joe looks this oh, up. Oh, no. Now. I'm not sure. Um, here, you know what? I'll even do voice to text. Hit me, baby, one more time. Release date. Hit me, baby, one more time. Was September 30th, 1998. 98? Wow. Okay. I mean, you know, it's close to 2000. I'll give you that. Damn, we're old. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Janice sent out Meryl. Oh. Do you think it's adorable? Yes. Confusion, growl, or switch? Confusion. Tail Whip, because it's level 10 and we're level 8, so our defense falls, but we Confusion, the cool psychedelic background, it did that much. Oh, not a lot. Fighter Switch. Uh, let's fight. Tackle does that much, 7 damage. Meryl is now confused. Do it again? Yeah. Okay, it's confused, and it hurts itself. Wow, nicely done. Okay. All right, one more should finish it. We want to try yeah. it? All right. Still confused, but it gets off a tackle, brings us to 10, and we use confusion and finish it off. Meryl faints, we gain one, two, three. Nice. Okay, and we defeated Janice. You're a notch above me. We got $160 for winning. Thanks, Janice. That's <laughs> sweet. Pokemon that possess cuteness and power? That's ideal, I think. Yeah, I don't know if mine are that cute, but yours is. <laughs> but it wasn't powerful. That's true. There's a bunch of empty patches in the grass here. Uh, we're cool with routes up top? Um, yeah. Because there's this dude over here. If the tunnel doesn't go through, then I'll just go over the top. Because he's a hiker. Hiker Clark would like to battle with three Pokemon. He sends out Geodude. Oh. Level 8. Confusion okay. or Growl? Uh, confusion. Wow. It did about half, and Geodude used Mudsport. 
Mud sport. Electricity's power was weakened. Oh. It's it's I've a never heard of it. It's a new move. We've never seen it before. Uh, and it's very stupid for him to use it when it's not a double battle. But anyway, oh. confusion. <laughs> he basically throws mud everywhere and weakens the power of electric type attacks. But because he's part ground type, electric type attacks do nothing to him anyway. So there's no reason for him to have used that unless he's gonna. The trainer is then gonna play another Pokemon that is weak to electric. Yeah. But it's a hiker, and they almost always have ground and rock types. Yeah, and it's even more stupid because we're not using an electric type. Correct. Ralts gained 147 and grew to level 9. Yay. So, 25 health, 11 attack and defense, 14 special attack, 13 special defense, 12 speed. Hiker Clark is about to use Geodude. Will we change Pokemon? Mm, I don't know. Do you think we should? We just got to level 9. Yeah. Ugh. We did just get to level 9. Yeah, no, let's keep using this. Okay. Very good. So Geodude comes in, also level 8. Just keep using Confusion. Yeah. Wow. Critical hit. Nice That's job, Ralts. Awesome. Geodude fainted, Ralts gained 147, which was about half. Hiker is about to use Geodude again. Yeah. Keeping it in? Yeah. Okay. Last Geodude is also level 8. We will Confusion again. And it did about half, and Geodude used Defense Curl. Want to try to finish it off? Yeah. See if it works. Oh, very close. Ooh. Tackle does five damage. Okay. That's, Doing it? Yeah. Okay. There goes Geodude. And we gain another 147. So close. Oh, damn. We defeated Hiker Clark. <gasps> Losing made me tired. <laughs> we got $320 for winning. It's no big deal if there's no tunnel. To a hiker, mountains are roads. <laughs> okay. Whatever, okay. dude. Can we go through guy? the grass a little bit? Sure. Because I just want to use Ralts against, like, uh a wild Pokemon that's, like, hopefully a pretty low level. <laughs> okay. Whoops. Okay. It's a Taylo. Level six. Okay. So, hopefully you got your wish. Peck does six Shit. damage and puts us to one. All right, let's switch out. Yep, two. Uh, let's switch out to... Um, well, uh, Poochiana. You got it. <clears throat> the beeping stops. Poochiana comes in. Taylor used Growl, so we would have been able to kill it, but there was no way we would have known that or risked it. Uh, tackle or Howl? Tackle. Peck does five. Tackle does that much. Okay. One Keep more going. Go. Okay. Growl lowers our attacks. We're at minus two attack now on Puchiana. Okay, one oh. more should do it. Yeah. Focus I really thought edge. it would die. <laughs> oh, no, I knew. E even before the Growl, I don't think we would have killed there. But <clears throat> okay. now we do. Tail of Fainted. Ralts gained 25. It's not enough. And Puchiana gained 25. It's not enough. All right. Well, just... we can go to a center now. Oh, okay. Are we close to one still? Yeah, I mean, kind of. We still gotta go through grass to get there, but... Okay. We can switch train. Yeah. Have we, talk have we talked about this thing? I don't think so. What do you think of this thing? It's ugly. It's ugly? Poochiana again? Yeah. This, if we beat this, Ralts will likely level up. Good. Wild Wismer used Uproar. Uh, Wild Wismer caused an uproar and is making an uproar. Oh, because it whizzes everywhere. Wow. Tackle, howl, or switch? Because that would cause an uproar. <laughs> uh, tackle. Does about that much. It used uproar. It dealt seven damage, and then Wild Wismer calmed down. 
Fight or switch? I'm afraid of dying. Let's switch. Two? Two. Uh, Torchic. Okay. So we take out Puchiana, we put in Torchic. Wismer used uproar again. Dealt six. Caused an uproar and is making an uproar. Okay. Scratch, focus energy, or growl? Scratch. Okay, did that much. Probably one more will kill. Uproar does seven? No. Six? Six. Scratch? Yep. Okay. That did it. Wismer fainted. Ralts gained 19 and leveled up to level 10. Nice. 27 health, 12 attack, 11 defense, 15 special attack, 14 special defense, 13 speed. Puchiena gained 19. Torchic gained 19. Nice. Okay. We'll still go to a center. This is probably our best bet here. Damn it, so close. Two tiles away. It's a Ninkeda. Yeah. Okay, we'll switch out Ralts. Puchiena, Zigzagoon, Torchic, Lotad, Surskit. Uh, Torchic. Whoops. Okay. And we'll eat it. That is not an option. <laughs> Peck is not even something that we have. I know. <laughs> All right, so it hardened, so its defense went up. We scratch. Does that much. Harden again. Defense goes up a second time. Okay, keep scratching. You got it. It used scratch and dealt three. What? Bitch. <laughs> and growl lowers attack. Attack. Yeah. Oh. Alright, scratch. And focus energy ups our attack? Ups our critical hit ratio. Oh. Okay, let's do that. You got it. Reach Get life. Pumped! <laughs> Did one damage, not very effective, and it gained one health back. Good, because we're gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Leech life again brings us to nine. Keep doing that one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright. Scratch, Scratch was only doing two uh three, I think. Okay, no crits. We're at six. There's the crit. Nice. Thank you, Torture. Nicely done. Alright. Ralts gained twenty seven, Torture gained twenty seven. Actually, nice. that was pretty close on Torture leveling up. Ah! Oh, shit. This was a trainer we have not gone to yet. Ugh. Okay. Whatever. We'll be able to do this. My Pokemon rule. Check them out. Okay. We'll be fine. He's got two Pokemon. It's Youngster Joey. Oh, again. Yeah. Level eight Zigzagoon. So we put in Ralts and then we switch it out for whom? Zigzagoon. All right. So we have our level 9 Zigzagoon. So there's used Tackle and dealt 5 damage. We've got Tackle, Tail Whip, Growl, or Headbutt. Headbutt. That's a good, good idea. Yep, does half. Growl lowers our attack. Headbutt again. Yes, please. This one might not kill thanks to the Growl, but it'll be damn close. Yep. Yeah. Tackle does 5 so more. We'll just tackle it. You got it. Finish it with a Tackle. Very nice. Zigzagoon fainted. Ralts gained 51. Zigzagoon gained 51. Nice. Youngster Joey's about to use Machop. Okay. Will we change Pokemon? Well, we will. I think Torchic is pretty much dead. <laughs> yes, that's correct. I mean, you can look. I mean, I guess I could use a potion on Torchic or Ralts, but... That's if I care enough. I'm pretty sure I don't. Well, don't forget. <laughs> don't forget, confusion is super effective on Machop if you wanted to do that. Mm. You don't have to, and I'm not necessarily advising it. Yeah, I guess. It's up to you. Not happy about it, but I think we should. Okay, so why don't we give a potion to Ralts? Okay, who's going to be in while we give that potion to Ralts? Do you want to just put Ralts in, then potion it up, and then confusion? Is that going to be safe? Yeah, because they're both going to come in at the same time. Okay. Then we use a potion on Ralts. Ralts will take an attack because 
we're using but an item. after we've used the potion. Okay. Correct. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So we take out Zigzagoon, we put in Ralts at 3 health. Machop comes in at level 10 as well. We use a regular potion. Regular potion will bring us to 23 out of 27. Yeah. That's okay? Mm -hmm. Very good. Machop uses Leer to lower our defense. Confusion. Whoops. That's the bag. <laughs> Confusion, I assume? Yes. You got it. We are faster. And over half. Probably two-thirds. Wow. And it uses focus energy, so its critical hit ratio goes up, but it's dead. So it does not <laughs> Obviously super effective. Obviously Machop goes down. We gain 187 on Ralts. And we defeated Youngster Joey. Nice. Ouch! A scrape! I have to put on a bandage. Aww. <laughs> I am stuck on Band-Aid brand. <laughs> Girl got $160 for winning. Bandages are signs of toughness. I've got a, I've got another one. <laughs> what you think you're like Nelly? <laughs> uh, was that reference old even at the time that this game was out? I'm curious. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. How many old references are we gonna make? How many times are we gonna prove that we're old? <laughs> All the times. Yeah. All the times. <laughs> Okay. She hopes to see us again. I hope not. <laughs> Alright, uh, are we continuing to train up there, or are we going back to the gym? Let's go back to the gym first. Okay, because there's no more train. It's just the gym later, obviously. Oh, yeah, I know. Okay. Alright, so we're ready? Yeah. Let's do it, then. Remember her name? Mm, Roxanne. That's right. She doesn't have to put on the red light. <laughs> Hello, I'm but Roxanne, she's gonna. the Rustboro Pokemon gym leader. I became a gym leader so that I may apply what I learned at the Pokemon Trainer's School in battle. We still haven't yeah, gone there, by the whatever. way. whatever. Would you kindly demonstrate how you battle and with which Pokemon? Yeah, she's very formal. I Correct. Know. Yeah, she went to the, the Pokemon Finishing School. Yeah. Geodude level 14 versus Ralts. Yeah, I like it. Okay. So we use Confusion. Okay, Rock Throw. Oh. Wow. Shit. What? Wow. Okay. I'm sorry. Low Tat or Surskit? Uh. Because I assume it's not Poochie and the Zigzagoon or Torchic, by the way. If that was a question. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh. Low Tad. Uh. You got it. Low Tad comes in. Absorb, I assume? Yeah. Defense Curl. Good, 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 good. So it is faster than us, but still. We use Absorb. And... Ooh, super close. Okay. Uh, she used a potion. Good. All right, and that should be it. It should be fainted now. Oh, actually, maybe not. It lived at, like, one health. <laughs> okay. Let's absorb again, I guess. She used another potion. This one should faint then. Because, yeah, with the way that those calcs work, that makes sense to me. Perfect. Geodude is down. Beautiful. Lotad gained 258 experience. Whoa. And grew to level 12. Okay. First level 12 Pokemon. 32 health, 11 attack, 14 defense, 16 special attack, 17 special defense, and 12 speed. Ooh, and almost to 13, in fact. Leader Roxanne is about to use Nose Pass. Will we change? Uh, no. Good call. Nose Pass comes in. More absorbs? Yeah. Rock throw first. We live it. Okay. We will not live a second one. Actually, after absorb, we very well may live a second one. Yeah. We do. Uh, don't we? We lost. Ooh. I think we lost 17 there. So if that was uh, a low roll and this is a high roll, we may not survive, but we wait, can try. It's out of 32. Cause... 
it was the first attack. We healed. So we healed up three points from 15 to 18. Yeah. So from 32 down to 15 is 17 points. We're now at 18 health. Yeah. It's not a guaranteed 17 damage every time. Oh. It's a range. Okay. So it, that could have been a low roll on the damage. Yeah. And then if it does a higher roll on the damage, it will kill us. Oh, okay. It could have also been a higher roll, and then we could get a lower roll and survive with like three or five. All or right. Whatever. Well, if it kills us, it kills us. I mean, we're level 12 at this point. It so. used Harden. Fuck you. That's great. That's in, that's incredible. Oh. Because it gives us more of a chance to heal up more. Yeah, but not actually do anything to it. I mean, it's still hitting <laughs> it for damage. It used Tackle. Oh, good. Fantastic. Love that. Why? That's so weird. Okay. Super effective. We only go to 16, though, so a Rock Throw could kill us. Well, let's try it. Rock Throw does kill us. We do have Surskit, which should be faster. Okay. Hopefully. Yes. And we've got Bubble. Okay. It is faster. Ooh, it's going to take a couple of those. Yeah. Rock 2 missed. Oh, nice. Which is good, because Surskit is a Bug-type Pokemon. Oh, shit. Along with its Water Typing, so Rock 2... Rock Tomb is what killed us in one hit last time. Yep. Alright, well, Nose Pass is almost dead. Correct. So, will we use Poochiena, Zigzagoon, or Torchic? Uh. Zigzagoon. It's a good call for the we'll headbutt. Use headbutt. Yep. It's a very good call. We'll headbutt it in the head! Because <laughs> that's all it is. It's just a head. Yep. Oh, when we're faster. Okay, nice. but. We've got the flinch! Amy, you're a genius. <laughs> okay, one more hit of anything should finish it off. Rock Tomb. We are level 9. Yeah, yeah. we lived! Uh-oh, our speed went down. Oh, uh, no, it's faster now. Shit. All right, Zigzagoon's down. Who's faster out of these two? Let's find out. 12 speed versus 14 speed. All right, Torchic. <sighs> Ooh, get a right. scratch off. Come on, Torchic. Rock throw. That's Damn it. it. Okay. It's gonna kill a Torchic in five seconds, because it's a bird. All right, All right Pucciana. Pucciana, do it up for us. Just need one tackle on this bastard. Just one. Just see if it lives. One. It yes. lived. Yes. We did it. We did it. The most pathetic gym win of all time. <laughs> <laughs> Phone hey, nose I'm pass. I'm proud fainted. of it. Uh, I, I'm nose not... pass was fucking hard. It's very difficult, yes. Poochiena gained 346 experience. Oh points. my god. Poochiena levels up on the backs of its teammates. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so level 9. Possibly into level 10 as well, I would think. 26 health, 15 attack, 13 defense, 9 special attack, 12 special defense, 13 speed. We learned Sand Attack. Nice. And grow to level yes. 10. Yes. Yep. yep, that does not Love surprise me. It. All right, so it's actually 28 health, 16 attack, 14 defense, 10 special attack, 13 special defense, and speed. Yay, double digits for everything. <laughs> and player defeated leader Roxanne. Nice. So, I lost. It seems that I still have much more to learn. I understand. The Pokemon League's rules state that trainers are to be given this if they defeat a gym leader. Please accept the official Pokemon League stone badge. Gruel got $1,500 for winning. Of course I'll accept. <laughs> Gruel received the stone badge from Roxanne. I actually like her, her fashion sense. You I do? Think she looks adorable. The stone badge heightens the attack power of your Pokemon. It might just be a uniform for her very fancy school that she goes to. I'm almost certain that's the case, yes. But again, <laughs> we still haven't been there, so we don't know. Yes. But it is if we want to go there later, we can. We don't have to. It's up to you. It also enables them to use the HM move Cut outside of battle. <gasps> yes, finally. Please, take this with you, too. Obtained the TM-39. We put away TM-39 in the TM in HM's pocket. Po yeah, pocket. The TM-39 contains Rock Tomb. Whoa, that was such a good move. <clears throat> it not only inflicts damage by dropping rocks, it also lowers speed. 
If you use a TM, it instantly teaches the move to a Pokémon. Remember, a TM can be used only once, so think before you use it. Thank you, Roxanne. I love you. <laughs> Since you are so strong, you should challenge other gym leaders. By battling many trainers, you should learn many things. Okay, do we want to talk to this guy? Yeah, the hype man. Whoa, what a breathtaking victory! My cheering must have worked. Great, check your trainer card. The stone badge you got should be properly recorded on it. In other words, you've climbed the first step on the stairs to the championship. That's gotta feel awesome. How would you know? You're just a hype man. <laughs> nah, he's like a he's like a signer, you know, like a Yeah, you know, he's my agent. Yeah. Get out! Out of the way! Oh shit. A robbery. Wait! Of, of papers. Please! Paper Don't robbery. take my goods! Oh. I guess goods instead of papers. Okay, well, we're going to ignore that because we need to go to the Pokemon Center because we have one Pokemon at 4 HP and nobody else. <laughs> well, fine. <laughs> there we go. Let's chase the rocket member. Okay. I mean, the Aqua guy. Correct. But let's look at our order. I'm a Barbie girl. Oh, my God. Oh, anyway, <laughs> uh, what order, is the order okay? Do we want to switch I, people up? I don't know, you know, fuck it, right, I, I don't know, I, you know. Oh, God, okay. <laughs> We're just gonna pretend that that never happened, everyone. I didn't hear anything, did you guys hear anything? I didn't, I didn't hear anything at all. Oh, it's you! You're that fantastic trainer who helped me in Petalburg Woods! Help me! I was robbed by Team Aqua! I have to get the Devon goods back! If I don't, I'm gonna be in serious trouble! We're gonna go help him? Mm-hmm. Okay, we gotta go this way. Back to Route 116, where we were before. We run into a wild Pokémon! It's a Whismur! Gross. Level 7. It's gonna pee on me. <laughs> Fight or switch? Confusion. It's dead. Wow, critical hit. One hit, Whismur faints, Ralts gains 68. Oh, so yes. close to nice. You wanna talk to this guy or keep going? Yes. Okay. Mm. What's going on? I was digging the tunnel without any tools when some goon ordered me out. That tunnel's filled with Pokemon that react badly to loud noises. They could cause an uproar. That's why we stopped using heavy equipment for tunneling. I'm worried that the goon will do something stupid and startle the Pokemon into an uproar. Wow. He was angry. He was angry because of all the roids he has to take so that he can dig tunnels without tools. <laughs> Tunneler's Rest House. Okay, so we've got this guy. You want to talk to him? Yes. Oh, what am I to do? We were on our walk, Pico and I, when we were jumped by an odd thug. The scoundrel made off with my darling Pico. Roar! Pico! Wow. <laughs> These people are very dramatic. <laughs> this is Rust Turf Tunnel, linking Rustboro and Verdon Turf. The tunnel project has been canceled. All right, let's go in the tunnel. Ew, it's like smoggy. Mm-hmm. So this is the tunnel. There's an item up there. And there's that guy. Item first. You got it. We found a Pokeball. Shit. I thought it was going to be something that would help us in battle. Mm, nope. Uh, we're cool with Ralts up top. Uh, well, it looks like he has a seagull, so we probably want to use a Pokemon we don't have, <laughs> so I guess we'll use Ralts. <laughs> okay. What, are you coming? Come and get some then. And then he backs away. Okay. I'm not scared. Grok, kill hole it all. 
That hostage Pokemon turned out to be worthless. And to think I made a getaway in this tunnel to nowhere. Hey, you! So, you wanna battle me? I just say, hey, you. We already had half a conversation. <laughs> Team Aqua Grunt would like to battle with one Pokemon. Okay. I love how, like, this dude was super aggressive. And he still kind of said, like, you want to battle me or whatever. But this is a forced fight, right? Like, this guy, we need to beat him in order to get the hostage Pokemon back and the Devon Goods back and all that other stuff. But it still is so kind. It's like, Team Aqua Grunt would like to battle. Like, requests <laughs> your attendance at this battle. And it sends out Poochiena. Well, level it's definitely no 11. Roxanne. Yeah. All right. Uh, confusion? Yeah. It doesn't affect Poochiena. <gasps> Ooh. You've learned something more about Dark-type Pokemon, Amy. <gasps> Psychic doesn't work on it. Psychic doesn't work on it. <laughs> I was, I'm very like it's pleased. it's an X one? Correct. I'm very pleased that you chose to stay in with, uh, with Ralts here so that we could learn that. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that being said, um, we can either growl or switch. Uh, let's, let's growl. Okay. How many times? Uh... 50 million! Alright, so its no. attack fell. It used Howl, its attack rose. Uh. Okay, whatever. Let's switch. <laughs> <laughs> to whom? Um, well. <sighs> Let's use Zigzagoon. You got it. Headbutt, tackle, tail whip, or growl? Headbutt. I used Howl. So it should be at plus two now, I think. Maybe plus three. You did say headbutt, right? Yeah. Okay. It flinched, which means... Yeah. It's done. We did it. Poochiena fainted. Ralts gained 64 experience. And Zigzagoon gained 64. Okay. And we defeated Team Aqua Grunt. Yeah. Erg, my career in crime comes to a dead end. We got two hundred and twenty dollars for winning. Because you lost this battle. That's what he said. This is plain not right. The boss told me this would be a slick and easy job to pull. All I had to do was steal some package from Devon. You want it back that badly? Take it. Obtained the Devon goods. I almost read that in that dude's voice. We put the Devon goods away in the key items pocket. He runs away. And there's this old man. Pico he comes into this smoggy ass cave. Yep. He shouldn't even be breathing in here. <laughs> Pico, am I glad to see you're safe. Pico owes her life to you. They call me Mr. Briny. Oh, he's the dude who wasn't at his house and doesn't bother to lock his damn door. And likes to go for walks in the cave. Dude, <laughs> it's smoggy as shit in here and you're old. <laughs> and you are? Ah, so you are Gruel. I sincerely thank you. Now, if there's anything that troubles you, don't hesitate to tell me. You can usually find me in my cottage by the sea. No, near... I can't, because I already showed up there, and it took me till now to find your ass. <laughs> near Petalburg Woods. You come, suck. come, Pico. We should make our way home. Pico. Pio. <laughs> That's not your name. <laughs> Okay, uh, to the right or back where we came from? To the right. There's rocks. It's a rugged rock, but a Pokemon may be able to smash it. Not any of mine. Correct. And so we run right out of here. Okay, you want to go up those stairs to the right or talk to this dude again or oh, God. go back this to the center or something? Sucked. Let's talk to him. Wow, I guess. nobody took any damage in that fight. Nope. Wow. <laughs> Talk to him, you said? Yep. Okay. Yeah. That goofy goon hightailed it out of the tunnel. I can go back to digging. I guess. You're really intense about it, though, dude. <laughs> like uh, I said, in... it's all the roids. <laughs> up into here or yeah. keep going? Okay. To get to Verdant Turf without using this tunnel, you'd have to cross the sea to Duford, sail onto Sail uh, Slateport, then travel through Mauville. 
Got that? It's going to be on a test later. Nope. <laughs> that rust turf tunnel there? At first, we had a huge work crew boring through rock with the latest machinery. But we had to stop. It turns out that we would have had a negative effect on wild Pokemon in the area. So we've got nothing to do but loll around here doing nothing. Oh, so if things like tunneling and fracking are bad for the environment and ecosystem, you shouldn't do them? Hmm. See, and I was going to make a union workers joke. And <laughs> not, not even being sincere about it. It's just, you know, that's the stereotype, which is not necessarily fair. Because props to all those guys, because I couldn't do any of that work. So <laughs> shout yeah, outs well. to every one of them. There's a man digging his way to Verdant Turf all by his lonesome. He's desperate to get through. He says that if he digs little by little without using machines, he won't disturb Pokemon and he'll avoid harming the natural environment. Okay. He's got like a little chisel. Yeah. <laughs> and he's in there just tick, tick, yeah. tick, 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 tick. Every once in a while one breaks and he goes, yay! <laughs> and it disturbs a wild Pokemon. <laughs> Causes like, an uproar. Shit! Yeah. Can't believe I've done this. <laughs> we have a wild Ninkata level seven. Do we fight or switch? Ugh, or uh, run? Yeah, fight. We use confusion. It did well over half. In fact, yeah. uh, like three quarters. Its defense went up, but that is irrelevant. Sure is. Ninkata fainted. We have a psychic type. Yes. And Ralts gained 65 and grew to level 11. And psychic types are OPAF. Correct. <laughs> which is why they introduced the dark type, which is immune to psychic. <laughs> anyway, 29 health, 13 attack, 12 defense, 16 special attack, 15 special defense, 14 speed. And Ralts learned double team. Nice. It's for all those double battles. You can double team your opponent's Pokemon. It's really it makes it really uncomfortable for everybody, to be no, honest. No, it doesn't. It does. Some of us are comfortable in those situations. Not with Pokemon, though. <laughs> no. Oh, how did it go? The Devon Goods? You did! You got them back! You really are a great trainer! Thanks. I know! As my thanks, I'll give you another Great Ball! We obtained the Great Ball. Of fire. <laughs> Gruel put away. Now it's great balls of fire because now we have two. Yeah. Gave us the first one and now the second. Excuse me, please, please come with me. This is the Devon Corporation's third floor. Our president's office is on this floor. Anyway, I can't tell you how much I'm grateful for what you've done. Um, by the way, that parcel you got back for us, could I get you to deliver that to the shipyard in Slateport? Oh, crap. Is this. Is this. Like weapons? Is this drugs? <laughs> is this people? Is there actual people in this? It would be awful if those robbers tried to take it again. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, could I count on you to do that for me? Are you gonna pay me? Oh, that's right. Could you wait here a second? You gotta pay me. You gotta pay me. Our president would like to have a word with you. Please, come with me. Oh, Christ. The dude was just right over I here. I get to talk to the boss, the crime boss. We could see him from where we were standing. <laughs> like, he, he asked us to wait. He walked away from us over to this dude at his desk, probably whispered something to him, and then instead of just saying, oh, hi, across the room, person that can blatantly <laughs> see me, could you come over here? He walked all the way back over to us and was like, our president would like to speak with you. Please come with me. And then walked us over and is now like, please, go secretary. ahead. Yeah, seemingly. Please, go ahead. So we step up. I'm Mr. Stone, the president of the Devon Corporation. I just got word about you. You saved our staff, not just once, but twice. I have a favor to ask of an amazing person like How you. How many fucking favors do these people want? I understand that you're delivering a package to Slateport Shipyard, which we have not agreed to yet, but he's just saying that we're doing it. Yeah. Well, oh, on, on the way, could you stop off in Duford Town? No. Can you suck a dick? <laughs> I don't want this child labor ass shit. Okay? I'm just trying to fucking get Pokemon badges. 
Where's the lie? I, I just, I ask you. <laughs> I, I just don't know. I was hoping you'd deliver a letter to Stephen in Duford. This happens all the time. <laughs> These guys are definitely into illegal activity. That's why it's so important that they get their fucking package back and that it goes to the right guy. And they're using a child to do it because they're like, well, the cops won't stop a kid. <laughs> Fuck you. Well, now it's just a letter. We're putting the letter away in the key item's pocket. Mr. Stone. Now, you should know that I am a great president... <laughs> Yeah, they all say that, don't oh they? Oh my god. I like how he's standing on his chair. <laughs> he's probably like two feet tall. <laughs> I have to tell you I'm a great president, by the way. So, I'd never be so cheap, here you go, as to ask a favor for nothing in return. Pay me. That's why I want you to have this. We received a Poke Nav. The fuck? That device. <laughs> it's a Pokemon Navigator, or PokéNav for short. It's an indispensable tool for any trainer on an adventure. Google Maps. It has a map, yep, of the Hoenn region. You can check the locations of Duford and Slateport easily. Good, because I get lost very quickly. I'm counting on you. And then I get very anxious that I've gotten lost. <laughs> and then I have panic attacks. <laughs> And then you know what happens? <laughs> the trade-off at the pier doesn't happen. And you know what happens then? We all die. <laughs> Drive by. Oh my god. So, <laughs> here's this Pokénev. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Hoenn map, condition, and trainer's eyes. Okay. So what do we want to check? Anything? All of it. All of it. Because I don't know what any of it is. Well, I would hope you know what the Hoenn map is. Mm, well. It's the map that we've okay. seen before. So we are in Rustboro City. They want us to go to Duford Town. So we have to take a boat? And Slateport City. Oh, God. Fine. Uh, I thought it was the pier. Now we gotta take a fucking boat. No, the pier is here in Petalburg. Oh, fine. Or near Petalburg. But thankfully, we just met a dude with a boat. Didn't we? We did. Mr. Briny. Uh, the one who yeah. you're so upset is never at home when you want him to be. Yeah, because he's never at home when I want him to be. <laughs> he's a grown man. <laughs> he's not at your beck and call for when he should be well, in his he home. he fucking should be. <laughs> he's old. He shouldn't be wandering around in caves breathing in smog. What are you, his granddaughter? No. Okay. Maybe. Who knows? Condition. The, the gym leader is our fucking dad and I didn't even know it. <laughs> Even though they told you multiple times. Shut up. <laughs> Check party Pokemon in detail. Check all Pokemon in detail or cancel. Party Pokemon! Wow. It's a party! Okay, so here's Ralts. Doesn't look like he's having a party. It shows you how cool, Shade. tough, smart, cute, and beautiful it is. That's dumb. <laughs> Same with Poochiena. Zigzagoon, Torchic, Lotad, and Surskit. Seemingly nothing. <laughs> so. They all looked the same. Yeah. And then Trainer's Eyes. Uh, there's. I'm sorry, what? Are these all the trainers we fought? Correct. Okay. Is that supposed to mean anything? Or be useful literally in any way whatsoever. <laughs> I don't know. I have never used this feature before in this game. Okay. It's a thing that exists. Well, well I'm so glad it does. Goodbye. <laughs> uh, do you want to talk to this guy again or just leave? Ugh, fine. If you visit the shipyard in Slateport, you should go see Captain Stern. That's all he says. Okay. I love what he says, if we go do that. Like, that's not a guaranteed, necessary next step in the game. Do we want to talk to any of these guys? Yeah. Okay. Just talk to all of them? It looks like they're making blueprints. I'm developing new kinds of Pokeballs, but I haven't made much headway. Oh, wow, that's a Pokenav. It came about as a result of our president's desire to learn about the feelings of Pokemon. Would you like me to describe its features in detail? Yes. 
No, no, I think you'll find out just by trying the Pokenav out. Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> it's empty. We're developing a device for talking with Pokemon, but we haven't had much success. Okay. I'm trying to develop a device that visually reproduces the dreams of Pokemon, but it's not going well. And I've been trying to develop a, a device that resurrects Pokemon from fossils. I've been trying to develop a way to uh, fuse with my Pokemon so I can live forever even though I'm terminally ill. <laughs> Ryan Reynolds was there. <laughs> <laughs> Shoutouts to Detective Pikachu, everybody. <laughs> and it's working! So this dude is the only successful person on this whole floor. <laughs> <laughs> okay, goodbye. Solid corporation, am I right? Jeez, dude, really? You want to talk to him or uh, leave? They're research and development, Joe. Yeah. They have to do research and then possibly develop. <laughs> Uh, no, it's called research and development, not research and possible development. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Your expectations are too high. <laughs> are we talking to this guy or leaving? Yes. Okay. Hi, guy. Hi there. You're always welcome here. Thanks. Lady, guy, or leave? Lady. How come all these guys are wearing, like, what I picture to be, like, uh... A burgundy velour sweatsuit. That is kind of what it looks like. Well, and then like a, a flavor flave clock nice. necklace. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's just a maroon sport coat and a yellow tie. Nah, nah, that's not what it is. <laughs> My mistake then. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the Devon Corporation. We're proud producers of items and medicine that enhance your life. This guy or leave? Yes. Sounds like they've recovered the ripped off Devon goods. That's yeah, they, I, I they sure have. I fucking did that. Prick. <laughs> um <laughs> Alright, we're okay with our team like this? Yeah. Alright, where do we want to go? Um I don't know. I guess uh we'll wander around in this town for a bit. Oh. Because isn't okay. there still stuff we haven't looked at? Like what's yes. this thing over here? This thing? Yeah. I mean or we the, went in that already. The crappy answer is it's a building, but, uh... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pokemon are such strange creatures. Your apartment is ugly. Every Pokemon has a special ability that it can use. Okay. We knew that, because we have Pokemon with those abilities. Y'all are dumb. There's a lady up here. Oh, it's so hard every day. Oh, what is? What's hard? You need to ask? It's trying to figure out what to make for meals every day. Yeah. I knew you'd love this lady. Simsies. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> Amy and this lady, best friends forever right here. <laughs> it really isn't easy coming up with meals every day. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> That's just... That's just, That's just you, all she cares about. You came up to the second floor of this house. Just to hear that. Well, preach into the choir, I guess. <laughs> Did we go here? Cutter's house. Oh, so we can get cut. Is that, his name Cutter, or he's called a Cutter because he cuts? I assume the second. Well, hopefully, he's not a Cutter, but you know. Yeah, they just make you put that put a sign outside of your house. <laughs> apparently, in this world, <laughs> I cut myself. It's so messed <laughs> up. So messed up. Yeah, that determined really expression, that limber way you move, and your well-trained Pokemon. You're obviously a skilled trainer. No, wait! Don't say a word. I can tell just by looking at you. Creepo. I'm sure that you will be capable of putting this HM to good use. No need to be modest or shy. Go on, take it. Oh, God. It's poison. <laughs> it's his dick. It's his dick in a box. <laughs> Put the HM01 in the TM's and HM's pocket. That HM, it's cut. An HM move is one that can be used by Pokemon out of a battle. Any Pokemon that's learned Cut can chop down thin trees if the trainer has earned the Stone Badge. And, unlike a TM, an HM doesn't break after one use. 
Let's talk to the wife. When they were expanding the city of Rustboro, my dad helped out. Oh, okay. I'm sorry your dad's a child molester. Wow. He made his Pokemon use cut to clear the land of trees. Look, if you wanna if you wanna create a dark timeline with this with these two people in this house, um, you should probably go a little bit further and just take the risk and say that she calls him her dad, but that's a hundred percent like she had another family years ago. Oh. And now if and you notice her if you notice with him. she is legitimately only walking back and forth between the tile next to the sink and the stovetop. Yeah. That is the only places she is permitted to go. She's like chained to the bottom of the refrigerator. <laughs> okay. I'm you're not, not the only foot, one. Though. Yeah. Well, you don't know that. You're not the only one that can create dark timelines I for things. I see shoes on her feet. Okay. But yes, she is only allowed in the kitchen. Correct. So, uh, what order would you like your Pokemon in as we traverse this uh, next leg of our journey? I'm sure she could help that lady who doesn't know what to make for meals. Because she never leaves the kitchen. Mm. Um, so let's put the Torchic at the top. And then okay. Zigzagoon. Okay. You got it. Yeah. So we're just going to go back down where we came from. Do we want to stop at the mart? Uh, yes. Okay. So let's check what items we have. Whoops, that's not where we find items. Let's check what items we have. We have five potions, four super potions, one escape rope, two paralyze heal, one awakening, one revive, three repels, an ether, and, and an X defend. Okay. All right, let's sell our X defend. Um, let's sell our clothes bag <laughs> yeah, definitely we don't need to close the bag ever nope uh, so we have $9,159 left now uh, we have 11 pokeballs 2 premier balls 2 great balls by the way nice and then we have bullet seed rock tomb cut etc so let's see what he has for sale pokeball potion super potion antidote paralyze heal escape rope repel x speed x attack x defend and cancel Okay, let's buy some potions. Okay, what do we say? We have three or something? Five currently? Five. Okay, so how many do we want more? Uh, how about five more? You got it. Okay. And how many Pokeballs did we have? Eleven. Oh, okay, that seems sufficient. Correct. I think we're good. I agree. Okay, just good to leave? Uh... Yeah, okay. I mean, I don't think we need anything else, really. We don't have any more antidotes, if that is relevant to you. Oh. Yeah, let's get a couple of those. Is a couple more than two? No. Okay. So we get two for $200. Very good. Then we're done. Okay. Okay, and uh, did you notice who's out here? Yes, I did. Want to talk to him? Yes, I will. Gruel, how's your Pokedex? Have you filled in any pages yet? Mine rules! I went on a Pokemon catching frenzy in Petalburg Woods until I ran out of Pokeballs. That's it. That sounds cool. I guess. But that's all he says. Okay. Hey, look. We can cut. But we haven't taught it to anybody yet. Oh. Booted up an HM, it contained cut. Teach cut to a Pokemon? Yes, please. Uh, Zigzagoon or Torchic? Oh. Not Lotad? Correct. What would he cut it with? I mean, he's a grass type Pokemon. Okay. Oh. Cut is a normal type it's attack. It's a normal type attack. Correct. I forgot. Yeah, because Beedrill had it in the first, in red. Yeah. And uh, Chikorita slash Bayleaf slash Meganium had it in silver. <clears throat> um, what does Zigzagoon have? Tackle, Headbutt, Tail Whip, Growl. Ooh. 
We could replace Growl with it. Okay. It seems silly when Torchic has like two attacks instead of four. Right. But I'm hoping Torchic will get like actually good stuff. Okay, if we level it up. For a fire type. Sure. Like, to make it like actually useful because I don't think fire types are that good. Okay. So let's give it to Zigzagoon. You got it. You said in place of Growl? Yeah. You got it. Um, so Growl comes out. So just so you're aware, Cut has 50 power and 95 accuracy. Nice. One, two, and poof. Zigzagoon forgot how to use Growl and Zigzagoon learned Cut. Do we care about Bullet Tomb or Bullet Tomb? Wow. Bullet Seed or Rock Tomb? Rock Tomb, definitely. I don't think we have any Pokemon that can get it, though. Torchic. Oh. Is the only one. Interesting. Or we can hold off. And that is a rock type move? Yes. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. That seems nice. Um. Yeah, that seems nice. Okay, let's do that. Oh, okay. Put it on Torchic. Torchic, you learned Rock Tomb. Bullet Seed? No. Okay. That seems shitty and dumb. <laughs> this tree looks like it can be cut down. Would you like to cut it? Yes. Zigzagoon used cut. Huh. That was cute. Isn't that cool? We found an X accuracy. Ugh. <laughs> Let's go to the mart and sell it. <laughs> okay. Hi again, Brendan. Okay. We would like to sell this X accuracy for $475. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we need to find a store that has more stuff. Okay. Well, we have two more towns that we've been mandated, tasked, asked, however you want to say it, <laughs> yeah. to go to. Okay, now do you want to... Oh, we can cut in this area. Yeah. We run into a wild Wurmple, level five. We've got Torchic, Scratch, Focus Energy, Rock Tomb, or Growl. Let's use Rock Tomb. Uh, it missed. How'd you know I was going to say Rock Tomb? Because you laughed. Oh. So it wouldn't be funny to use Scratch. It's funny <laughs> to use Rock Tomb because you just got it. Oh, okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> I mean, I'm not wrong. Oh, this... it's still alive. Yes. String shot lowers our speed. And so we scratch it now? Yeah. Yep. Okay. It's I wonder if we, dead. I wonder if we level up here. Wormple fainted. Torchic gained 38. And nice. grew to level 10. <clears throat> so... 32 health, 18 attack, 15 defense, 21 special attack, 16 special defense, and 15 speed. Torchic is trying to learn Ember. Ooh. But it can't learn more than four moves. Delete an older move to make room for Ember. Yes. Scratch, Growl, Focus Energy, or Rock Tomb. Growl. Makes or sense. Be focus Energy. Nah, Growl. I was going to say, it's too late now. But, oh, well. But I, I don't know. I would say Focus Energy is probably better for you. It ups your critical hit ratio on any attack. Yeah. So, yeah. And Torchic learned Ember. But to be fair, if there's another move that Torchic would get that you want to make uh, yeah, him forget move for. Yeah, that one's also going to get deleted yeah. eventually. So. And that's fine. There's a lady over here. Lady. <laughs> All right. Uh, are we cool with keeping Torchic up top? Yes. Or do you want to? Okay. Let's talk to her. 
Her hair is cool. Oh, neat. That's the badge from Rustboro Gym. You must be a trainer. You should try using this item. Obtained the Miracle Seed. Oh, nice. We put away the Miracle Seed in the items pocket. You remember what this thing does? Yeah. We it's a Miracle it's Seed. Tag. If a Pokemon holds that item, its Grass-type moves become stronger. Besides Miracle Seed, I think there are other convenient items for Pokemon to hold. You said give it to Lotad, right? Yeah. Okay. I mean, he doesn't have anything right now that's, that's useful, right? That oh, no, wait, no, true. Absorb. Correct. Correct. Okay. <laughs> All right. Up or down? Up. There is an item. It's a Great Ball. Nice. More in the grass or over the ledge? More in the grass. It's a Zigzagoon. Level five. We've got Torchic. Scratch, Focus Energy, Rock Tomb, Ember. Rock Tomb. It missed. Tackle does seven with a critical hit. Try it again. That time it worked. Its speed fell and it did over half. Nice. Now what? Alright, now let's uh, do it again. Yeah, because I think it would take a few scratches to get the rest of the way there. So. Okay. Rock Tomb finishes it off. Torch it gained 42. Okay. More in here. I was going to say no, but oh, okay. It's a Silcoon. So ugly. Level five. So I, I think that's an eye sticking out. Correct. Like a hole in it. Yes. And he's looking through the glory hole. Correct. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if we can rock to a cocoon. It's up to you. Let's try it. It hits. It is super effective. <laughs> Silcoon fainted. Torchic gained 50. Okay. So you said no in this more, right? Correct. Down here? Yes. Wow. First tile. It's a zigzagoon. It's not a tile. It's a bush. <laughs> yeah. It's actually just tall grass. Scratch. You're tall grass. Thanks. Scratch, Ember, Rock Tomb, Focus Energy. Rock Tomb. It missed. It likes missing. It probably has low accuracy. We didn't check. Or at least I don't remember checking. It missed a second time. Yay. Do it again? Yeah. It missed a third time. Yay. Try again? Well, can we do anything about it? What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> About it missing? Yeah. No. So, I guess so. Okay, it's our last one. Okay. It missed. Well, that's dumb. We missed four in a row. And in fact, let's check. What the hell is that thing's accuracy? 80. So with no, a 20% chance to miss, we missed four in a row. No, it's not. Okay. That's a uh, fucking lie. <laughs> scratch or Ember? Uh, oh, Ember. I forgot. Did you? Oh. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's uh, it did a lot of damage, and it burned Zigzagoon. Zigzagoon tackles for three. Hurt by the burn. Okay. Let's scratch it. Good call. Zigzagoon fainted. Torch it gained 42. We move on. There's an item. It's an X attack. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. More through the grass. It's a Silcoon. Level five. Okay. Uh, let's ember it. You got it. I'm gonna explode this motherfucker. It did finish it off in one it hit because died. it's super effective. <laughs> wow. Silcoon fainted. Torchic gained 50 and grew to level 11. Yes. 
34 health, 19 attack, 16 defense, 22 special attack, 17 special defense, 16 speed. Okay, and then we're back down to this guy whom we've met already. Sometimes there are things on the ground, even if you can't see them, that's why I always check where I'm walking. Blah, blah, blah. Give them to me. Crap. I didn't actually mean to walk through that grass. Apologies. It's a Wurmple level 5. Ember. Okay. We'll ember it. Then I say, when we get out of here, super effective by the way, uh, if we didn't know that already, 38 experience points for us. When we get out of here, I suggest that we go to the center in Petalburg. And then maybe we can call it an episode. Yeah. Because that's been quite a lot today. Yeah, because I would have asked to go to a center, but I didn't know how far away we were. Yeah. So we're right here, and then that means directly west of this city, if we go through the um, sandy area, is Mr. Briney's cottage, if you recall. Okay. Um, and so we might be able to ask him for some transportation via boat to all the 57 different places that we need to go that the game very much uh, ham-fisted us into going to following our win at the gym. Yes. So that is going to be the end of this particular episode. Please let us know what you thought down in the comments below. Were you happy with how we won that gym battle? Did you think it was a little cheap? Uh, did you think that we got lucky? Any and all thoughts that you might have, we would really appreciate hearing from you. Yes. Uh, in addition to commenting, we would love it if you would do all the other fun YouTube stuff. You can like the video, share it, subscribe, and ring that bell so that you'll get notifications whenever any of our videos come out, including the continuation of this series Indeed. as soon as it is released. And so... For now, from us here at the Geek for All family of channels, I've been Joe. And I'm Amy. And as we always say, in whichever video of ours you watch next, we will see you all next time. Thanks, everybody.